Make sure you're running the most recent version of Data Rescue PC3. This can be done by checking the About button. To begin, click on the Wizard button. In the Wizard, we'll choose a drive from the top and select Next. It's important we choose a drive on the top and not the file system on that bottom. Then hit Next on the bottom. In the scan window, after you've verified that this is the drive you want to run the scan on, then hit Next. Or if you are trying to load a previously run scan, then choose the Load Scan window on the bottom left. This will open another window to locate the scan bin file to load the scan. The scan will now run and when finished will present the results. Once the scan is finished, then Data Rescue PC3 will ask you to save the scan. After selecting yes, choose a location like the desktop or an external drive to save the scan to. Now you'll have to choose a partition and select next. So Data Rescue PC3 will load the scan results for that partition after building the B-tree. If you are running a scan after reformatting a drive, then you want to look at the raw sectors for data. In the scan results, under root will be subfolders for documents and pictures. Choose the folder and check mark it by right clicking on it. Once these folders are marked, then choose recover from the top. Data Rescue PC3 will now ask you to choose a drive to recover this data to. As soon as the recovery finishes, then you are done. Now you can open the external hard drive and browse through these files.